Israeli troops pushed deeper into Gaza Friday, destroying rocket launching sites and tunnels reportedly operated by Hamas. Israel launched the high stakes ground offensive Thursday night, firing tank shells and clashing with Palestinian militias. In this Israeli Defense Forces footage, troops and tanks stake out positions in Palestinian neighborhoods. Israel's Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu ordered the army to prepare for a significant expansion of ground operations. It is not possible to deal with tunnels only from the air. Our soldiers are also doing it from the ground. There is no guarantee for 100 percent success, but we are doing our best to achieve the maximum. Israeli leaders have said the aim is to weaken Hamas militarily, but have not addressed the possibility of driving the Islamic militants from power. Hamas has survived Israeli offensives in the past, and on Friday in Gaza City, one Hamas official warned that Netanyahu has made the wrong decision. It is clear that Netanyahu took the wrong direction to have a ground operation in the Gaza Strip. The resistance will stand strong. The occupation will regret this decision when resistance turns Gaza into a graveyard for the attackers. Scores of Palestinian children and their families have taken shelter in United Nations schools in Gaza City. The UN Refugee Agency says some 17,000 Palestinians are spending time in special shelters set up in 20 schools. Clem Ritchie, Associated Press.